What's up everybody? Here we go with some Facebook ads videos. So let's get started. Um, we're going to be using our uh, our client that we've been running through in this course quite a bit, which is Murder Burger. So what we need to do is, there's two types of um, ads that we can run for our clients. The first one is Comment Growth Tool, and the second one is JSON Ads. I'm going to show you how to set up the Comment Growth Tool. Um, I'm not going to go super in depth with it, but essentially what you have to do is you have to go on to your client's Facebook page, right? So we go on their Facebook page. Murder Burger. Okay, and then we go in here. And then we need to make a post. And so what we do is we write, I'll, I'll try find, I'll scroll back through my previous posts and I'll show you the uh, post that we made for this chatbot already because this list I don't know if you guys remember but Murder Burger already has um, already has a chatbot list of 537 people okay so what let me keep scrolling back Okay, so this is the post we made. We made a post to this Facebook page and it said, Giveaway, hey Auckland, we have a $50 voucher to give away. Everyone who enters gets a two-for-one real ice cream milkshake. Simply comment below and we'll send you a coupon in Messenger. Okay, so what you do is you find some beautiful HD photos of whatever item you're promoting, which in this case is a two-for-one real ice cream milkshake, which is, which is this photo here. Um, nice HD photography. I also chucked in some other nice photos of the food that Murder Burger has. And then we created this post. And then what you do is you save your post as a draft, right? And once it's saved as a draft, you go to your dash, uh, your dashboard and mini chat and you click growth tools. And then you click create new growth tool. And then you scroll down to see uh, Facebook comments. You click on Facebook comments and then you go select a post and then you would select uh, the, then there's four options up the top publish posts, scheduled posts, promotable posts and custom Let, let's actually use the situation where we, we don't uh, we write the copy and insert the images on the Facebook page and then we schedule it for, for some date and then what we do is we click here and we look for scheduled posts and these are some scheduled posts that are coming up um, and then we would select the post in which uh, our chatbot ad is. So let's say theoretically this post was scheduled, would see it here. Let's just use this one for example. Assuming this is the scheduled post here, um, this is what it would look like. So then you click, I confirm that this selected post is the one that I want to use my messenger tool for. And we would call this... Um, Two four one is ID sides comments. Okay, so that's what we would call it, and then we go next. Then over here we say this is the message that people get as soon as soon as they uh, comment on the post. So they'll leave a comment. Facebook message messenger will send them a message. So this chat bot will send them a message saying, "Hey Daniel." And then what we need to say is simply reply to this message to enter and get your coupon. Okay, and then we just put a little down finger emoji like that. And then we click next, and then we click send to everyone who replies, and we replace this, we click replace here, and we pick our flow two for one sides intro, select this flow, and then we click save and activate. And then once this scheduled post on the Facebook page is posted, it will automatically uh, be, be ready to go with the chatbot. So anyone who comments on that post 
will get um, will get uh, opted in to the chatbot. Um, and once it's posted, you can actually run Facebook ads to that post. So as soon as it's you schedule it for a certain time, let's say 5 p.m. in the evening, you as soon as it posted, you would go into your client's ad account, which we've created the ad account here, Murder Burger. I'm going to leave that because people are messaging me. Um, and then you would create an ad. And I'm not going to go in too deep with this ad stuff because um, I assume you guys know how to run Facebook ads. But um, what I can't teach you everything to know about Facebook ads. But um, what I do is I click PPE um, engagement campaign. And then I'll call this, you know, uh, 241 sides PPE. So pay per engagement. That's the, the word I use for myself. Then I'll uh, create that. And then I'll, you always do radius based targeting. So you would select, um, you would search the address for Murder Burger. I know where it is. So for me, Murder Burger is right around here okay so that's where murder burger is located and then i'll change this to three mile radius around the business so these uh this facebook ad spend is only going to um be used for people in a three mile radius and let's say they only want to target people 21 to 49 say um, that's a very big audience. 320,000 people is quite big for this for a three mile radius, but um, you can you can tighten it up if you want. And then we need to go edit placements, and then we I like to do just mobile, so just people on their mobile, and I just want it in the Facebook news feed. So I unclick everything here, and I would pick a budget. You know, I would typically only run a comment tool for a few days, so maybe between two to five days, and I would spend $20 a day. Um, if I'm going to run it for five days, I would spend it for $20 a day. If I'm going to run it for longer, I would spend it uh, more. Um, but that's sort of what, what I would do there. Um, what I'm going to do is later on I'm going to create an advanced Facebook ads portion of this course but right now I'm just showing you the basic the basics um, I'll get into the advanced stuff a bit later um, that might be in, in a few weeks um, from from when I'm recording this video which is 7th of Feb but um this this is enough to do the basic stuff so let's say we run it $20 a day for uh, till the seventh let's just say for a week okay so we're gonna spend hundred forty dollars um, you might not have enough budget for that but um, that's you know that's dependent on how much you charge your client um, and then what I'll do is just obviously select the murder burger page and then I'll select the post um, in which I've got my chatbot running and it's already been posted um, and then you just uh, confirm. So that's pretty much how you run the comment growth tool ads. It's just boosting a post, essentially. Targeted boosting a post um, bought by age and uh, radius-based targeting. So, and only targeting mobiles on the mobile newsfeed. So that, that's pretty much it there. Um, never target Instagram, just use the feeds. Um, do it like this and you'll get the best result. Um, so obviously you can run these paper engagement ads however you want um, but yeah that's that's pretty much how you do them it's pretty much how you do them so it's pretty self-explanatory so uh, I hope that makes sense guys and um, I'll see you in the next video cheers